Take five total body workout with giant sets. Five movements, 60 seconds each with the 20 seconds rest. Cleans, seated front squats, upright rows, hammer curls, drop down weighted jump squats for cardio. Let's get Begin by standing with the T3 bag on top of your feet with the two D straps facing you. Squatting to the bag, grasp the D handles, using the overhand position and lift, inhale, lift powerfully to stand up. Extending your knees up, keeping a soft knee bend, the heels off the ground for maximum press. Just practice that. Back on the ground, press up, boom. Focus on the breath, inhale, up. This movement is great because we're going to use this for, for everything that we do. So get to practice in, get your practice reps in here. Breath, inhale up, there you go. Seated front squats. Grab the D straps using the overhand grip. Clean the bag up to your chest. You want to engage your core. Draw your navel in to your spine. Pull the bag up and it sit right on top of your chest. Elbows up, facing forward. Keep the bag there. From there, just slowly descend down to your platform. Have a seat. Boom. Plant your feet. Stand up. Push through. Good. Keep breathing. Working your breath, keep your navel to your spine, work your core at the same time. You use your abdominal muscles to, uh, to, to keep a nice core in this movement. Keep your elbows up high, you'll be working your upper back. Good. Keep, yeah, work on the breath. Stay with the breath. Nice. Nice. Three, two, one. Good job. All right, Rose. Come in from the squat position, stand up, pick up the bag by the D handles, using the overhand wide grip position. As you stand up, chest up, drive through your legs, keeping your knees slightly bent, pull back up towards the chin. Just pull it slowly up toward the chin. You wanna to try to keep your hands under the chin and elbows slightly higher than the hands. Slowly lower the bag to the starting position and repeat up. Good, nice and easy. Breathe through. Try not to lean back on this movement. Keep your spine tall. Good job. Next movement, hammer bicep curls. Grip the bag by the T3 straps. I like to grab all those straps, bring them together in one hand. I'm using a neutral grip position. I'm standing with a tripod with my feet. I want to make sure my, my feet are strong on the ground. Keep my elbows tight to the side and slowly bring it up just like you're using it. Like you might have a hammer and you're hammering a nail. It's kind of like what we're doing with this bag here. So slowly, we're gonna work on the entire bicep, the length of the bicep, making that strong, slowly come all the way down, extend, breathe up. Now we're gonna change quickly. We're gonna go into a traditional um, curl. We're gonna mix, mix in the two bicep curls together. 
Good, let the hands come over, down, extend. Out, they come up. Feel the bicep in this movement. Slowly extend, release it. Come on up. Next movement, weighted jump squats. Love this one. Used to do them with the bar on my back, back in the day. This time we have this soft bag on our neck. So you wanna grab the bag just like you're doing a, um, a seated rear squat. Hold the bag by the outside straps. And just down and up, down and up, down and up. You can go down to a full squat and then explode up or you can use a short stroke. It's up to you, but either way, this is that great heart rate intensifier that's going to really get that heart rate up and engage your muscles. Stay with it. It's a drop down, so when you get to a certain point where you can't do any more, drop the bag, let that bag go, boom, and then bam, just keep going. Let that 50 pounds off your back or 100 pounds or whatever you got and then drive your body up. Drive your body up. There you go. Good, burn through it, burn through it. Feel that, feel that, explode through it, explode through it. You got 60 seconds of this. Good. Yeah, nice, nice, go. Keep coming, keep going, keep coming. Three, two, one, go. Now you're done. Let's repeat it. 